Hi, Alex Forte here, The Art of Simple Golf. I'm going to give you a really quick lesson today on something that I get asked a lot is kind of like how do the hips move? I'm just going to give one simple thought. Um, you'll be able to see it from down the line, but also uh, front on as well. These couple of elements are going to give you the compression and that consistency of low point through the ball. And you know what? It's freaking easy. So please like and subscribe to the channel. And if you have any questions, just leave them below. Let's get into it. The hips move. Basically, I'm not. I'm trying to make this as short and sweet as uh, as possible. But the goal swing is always going to kind of have the movement doing this a little bit too much, or people hanging back too much on their heels. But the feeling that I want, instead of trying to think that you need to rotate the hips, like rotate them out that way, spin the hips for power. That's not going to work at all. It's a lot easier than that. But all I want you to feel as you're moving through the ball, okay, is that this rear side, whether you're left-handed or right-handed, you figure it out. But I want this trail side to be staying back. We don't want this hip sort of pushing forward. Whether you hyperextend or not and close that gap, or whether you do this a little bit, all right? I know, I know, because I do this a little bit, okay? But as we come through the ball, all right, we want to feel like we're keeping this back a little bit. And you've probably seen the wall drill, chairs or whatever, that's great, but you can't hit golf shots like that, can you? So as you swing and hit a golf ball, I want you to feel like, okay, I want you to feel like as you come through, this, even though you're turning the left side and straightening the left leg, I want you to feel like this right hip is actually staying back, okay? So it's not this movement. We're not spinning the right hip towards the target. We're just pulling the left back, but keeping the right where it is. Does that make sense? So we don't want the, we don't want to open the hips by the right side coming through or spinning through. We don't want that. We want the right side to stay back. So we want the left to open, we want the left to open, the left leg to straighten, and extend and lift up this way, but we want to keep the right side back. Okay, we want to keep that right side back. So trying to hit some shots, even just little diddy ones. Okay, let's just set up to the ball here. We're just going to hit some little diddy ones, but keep it that right side back. And that's just a little wee chip shot. But the feeling I had was this staying back. Opening up the left, straightening that left leg, but keeping the right side back. That sort of moves through the hips. Again, I just want you to try this with little chip shots, feeling like this. That's the sensation that you want. The left side coming up, but we haven't at any point moved this way. That's not gonna do us any favors. So stay, keep back here, turning that way, see? Even if you have to hold a club or something like that, you can open and turn, but keep this right side back. Dead simple. Just little half shots to extend. Then pick that one up, but there you go. Okay, so give that a try. Okay, so that was a pretty simple, easy lesson, wasn't it? Just try that feel. Don't get too complicated with movements, with positions or anything like this, but that should help you stay a little bit more neutral should help you with your goal swing somewhat too. Um, like for the consistency in that low point. But there's tons we can cover on this when we look at you know, the Art of Simple Golf swing system and the gears of golf, which we are gonna get into, uh, especially this winter. So yeah, that's a question I get asked a lot. Hopefully that helps a little bit. I, the reason why I didn't go into detail or waffle too much because I just want you to focus on that feel. Keep the right side back, straighten the left leg and pull it open. Whether you're able-bodied 
or whether you've got a few limitations, you should be able to find your way of doing that, okay? Don't force it, start small, but it should be less strain on your body when you do it correctly. And it's gonna help your low point, help your contact and all that fun stuff. All right, um, if you have any questions, leave them below. Please like and subscribe because I'm, uh, you know, I'm wanting to grow this channel, especially in 2021. So um, let's get into it. Hi, I'm Alex Forte and I want to introduce you to the Art of Simple Golf Club. This was born out of the overcomplication that plagues the golf industry, that kills your golf game. So what we have done is recreate a real golf club that you play wherever you are in the world online. So we have the clubhouse, we have the 19th hole, we have the putting green, the short game area, the driving range, the lesson tee, and we have the golf course where it matters the most to really help you play your ideal golf game every time you tee it up. We have new courses added every single month to help you go from A to B all the way through to Z. These series are designed to help you play your very best golf without overloading you with information, with just one or two bite-sized tips that you can go and apply right now. I will see you on the other side.